Howdy folks, I want to show you Buggy Exchanger version 1.1. I added in some functionality here. So we've got a zoom screen, as you can see here. Got some the ability to zoom in and out. You can also use the scroll wheel to zoom in and out. And if you right click, you can drag out a square from wherever you click as the center, and then you can drag out a square. So if you want to you know, go to the iron mine, you can do that. You want to go down here you can do that so yeah and then you can move it around but anyway and let's go like this and what you can uh, do here is we've got some trees as you can see here there's the trees so let's choose a map file let's just go like this and as you can see we have the red are the trees that are removed so you can show those you can zoom in here see your tracks here and everything so as you can see like we have over here whoops and I used the wrong mouse button so over here on our track I there's a bunch of trees that are really close to the track and everything because I never got to those so what I want to do is I'll show you here is I want to we we'll do an auto tree and you can do whatever radius you want let's go 15 and auto tree and there you go so it cleans off all the tracks. Now I do not have it cleaning off all of the uh, industries yet, but what you can do is you can paint. So you can use it here, we can turn the red back on so you can see what it's doing. But yeah, as you, if you just click and drag and you can remove all the trees. So we'll do this, we'll remove these ones from over here, remove these ones from over here. And um, yeah, so you could do something like, here, I'll show you. We'll do a 100 meter radius. So if you want to paint a huge, now if you try to go really fast, it's just going to skip like this, <laughs> as you see. So it takes a second. So you have to you have to drag a little slowly. But I mean, seriously, if that's if that's a problem for you, then <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Um, it's it's not paint. You're because you're deleting trees. Okay. So anyway, um, that's how that works. You can also have it plant all, and it'll put all the trees back in. And I don't want to do that because I want to show you what this save looks like. So we're gonna we're going to um, save this. We'll out this. I'll put this to slot six, and we'll hit save. And there we go. And it's saved to slot six. So I'm gonna load up the game and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, we are in the game and let's go up here. As you can see, there's a lot more space for those of you who actually watch my let's plays. Yeah, there's a nice huge space between all of these between the trees and everything as you can see here and so if we go up let's go up in the air you can see here where we deleted this big section here pretty cool and all the ones that were uh, that were close to the tracks yep all the ones that were close to the tracks so they're they're all gone now too so that's how you can do that and then you can just paint over I mean you, if you've got tracks around the industries you can see where they are and you can just paint around them if you want to but yeah, I just wanted to show you that, and that's it for this version. The next version, I want to see if maybe I can add in. See, we we did those spots over there too. <laughs> but yeah, next next version, I want to see if I can add in um, a couple more tools. So yeah, let me know what you think, and uh, thanks.